On the menu today, beautiful people, is some fish in tomato sauce, which is very easy to put together and it's absolutely delicious. So I have with me here my fish. I've already washed, taken out everything that needs to be taken out and I'm giving it a second wash, but this time with lemon infused water. So I'll go ahead and squeeze my lemon juice all over the fish. I'll add some water and some salt and that is all i'm using to clean this fish you know you can fry your fish with just salt water and it will taste good that's the whole idea the lemon will make it smell good and even when you wash it you feel you know the difference in your hand your your fish will feel so so fresh so once i'm done washing it i'll just set it aside it was a meal prep day and i was doing this among other things i was just prepping my ingredients i wasn't ready to use it immediately so i keep it in my fridge if you are ready to use it you can just go ahead and use it now for my veggies i'll be smoking them today and i'll be using some tomatoes some garlic onions red um, bell pepper and some scotch bonnet peppers these ones are really huge so i'm using just four of that i smoke this in my oven for about 20 minutes and then yeah that was it i'm also putting pouring some oil into my saucepan into that i'm adding some onions that i'll fry i'll also add in some bay leaves for that extra flavor there was something i skipped i sprinkled a little oil on my onions before I smoke so take note of that I've been giving this Mr. Chef cubes to try and review so I'll be doing that this is the very first time I'll be using it now I've blended all my smoked ingredients and I'm frying it in the oil I rinse out my blender nicely and add that to it it's very important that I dilute this with some water. I smoked this because I wanted that smoky effect and then sprinkling a little oil over your onions also enhances the taste. The cube is quite huge so I'm using just half of that and I must say that just using the cube I could taste it. It was really nice. I'm adding some homemade spices that I made including some herbs of which I have the recipes on the channel and then I'll go ahead and give this a nice day feel free to add any spices of choice at this point i tasted for salt i needed a bit more so i added some salt to taste i'll now go ahead and get out my fish and then put all of them in my sauce i want this to be covered in the sauce that way it will be nicely cooked so you want to check the saucepan that you are using you want this to be covered um, or you want the fish to be nicely covered in the sauce and then i'll cover this and and then leave it under low heat and I'll check it from time to time every now and then I just come and turn it around carefully because it's fresh fish and it can break easily but then after about 20 to 35 minutes under low heat this is what we have it's nicely done and cooked all I go is I had to do is to sprinkle some parsley over it for fragrance for beautiful taste and also as a garnish and this was absolutely delicious as i mentioned it was just easy to put together smoke your ingredients okay with a little oil remember to sprinkle a little oil on the onions blend it add some water add your meat and let it cook down and on this day we had it with some fancy kinky we have plans to have it with some yam some rice which we did on other days and it was absolutely delicious it is very important that you know how to store this as well should there be some leftover okay you want to keep them in you know different different bowls so each bowl had about two to three fish um depending on how you serve your family so when you take one you just take that one um, that one out microwave and then use it thank you so much for watching please don't forget to like follow me on facebook and subscribe to my channel thank you